Hey, it's Matt with McGee Farms and uh, had a uh, issue with the brush hog the other day. We had a uh, bolt come off of it and uh, getting ready to replace it. Going to show you how to do it. It's the, I don't know what you would call it, the uh, stabilizing brace or the stabilizing pin because it hooks up to these stabilizers here or a cradle pin, whatever you want to call it. Uh, just a bolt that goes through there, but you can't use just a bolt. You need uh, a little bit more, and that's because you need kind of a spacer in the middle to hold this out so you can get your third arm in there. And uh, I went up to the uh, only store we have close by is uh, Tractor Supply, and I ran up there, and of course they didn't have anything, so I got something that I'll make work. And... Grabbed this bolt, figured out what bolt I needed. I've got washers to go on the outsides, but I've got a whole bunch of these uh, uh, lock washers that I'm gonna put in the middle, basically to space it out to keep it apart far enough. And the reason that I use these instead of the bigger ones is because, you know, these are kind of close. I was afraid the bigger ones might actually interfere with here. So I'm going to put it on right now, tighten it up, and uh, show you the end product. So I've got it in there. Probably could have used a few more washers, but at least it's going to hold it open a little bit. They, they probably sell spacers. The spacers they had at Tractor Supply when I was up there, uh, it would have taken probably one spacer wouldn't have been enough. Two would have been way too much. So possibly could have done like spacers and some washers as well. But I just figure washers are, you know, cheaper. And uh, you, know, you want to make sure you get these stabilizing arms on the outside. And then once you get her done, just as simple as putting your washer on, tightening your bolt down, and I'm going to go get a uh, couple of big wrenches and tighten it up you know, super tight, but if it falls off, that's a simple way that you can fix it. Uh, but like I said, I tried it, first time I tried it, wasn't thinking about spacers or washers, and this thing would just collapse in, and it just made it a pain in the rear to try to hook up uh, the third arm on the uh, brush hog, and had to get kind of like a crowbar and like pull it apart every time, so. Figured uh, try some washers. It's Matt with McGee Farms. Hope you like the video. If you enjoy the videos, please consider giving us a thumbs up and like it. Subscribe to the channel or leave us a comment. It's appreciated and it helps the channel grow. Till next time, have a great day.